Well, hello everyone, what is going on? It is the Almighty Jeff, and we are here with episode 41 of Assassin's Creed for Black Flag. In the previous episode, we completed the final memory of Sequence 10, which had us heading into the observatory with Roberts, who, after we learned a bit about how it works, was ultimately betrayed, and um, we were the soldiers to the Jamaicans for our crimes, because we had a bounty on our head. And we would then boot it out of the Animus after they had found out about the hacking, so they'd put the base under lockdown and we'd basically put into sheltered accommodation kind of thing. And John had us hacking into the mainframe to apparently wipe our records so that they can't trace us any longer, but in fact it was something to do with bringing back Juno, who he intended to um, put her consciousness inside our body, but it didn't work, so he got pretty angry with that, and we just studied our way back into the Animus, and then it cut to us on the um, on the Jamaican prison island, uh, basically we were offered a way out by Rogers and uh, Torres if we give up the observatory location, but it doesn't seem that we have done, um, and Anne and Mary were briefly put off from hanging because they're apparently pregnant and we've just made our escape because Atabai has come to uh, help rescue them and basically needs our help. So that's all there is to it. Now we have a couple of optionals. Um, one is to hijack bells and another is to visit old friends. And I think those old friends might be some of our former, well, our former friends who didn't make it out. So, they're about somewhere on this island. I'm not just quite sure where, but. No witnesses. Okay, it's one bell down. We're in Kingston. I was thinking then, I was like, hang about. I recognise this area. Oh. Rightfully so. Um should I wait to tell any particular word. Hold you Everyone's uh come back, you cop piece. Is that a bio over there? Hey, what? Okay. Apparently, it doesn't matter if you get caught. That's definitely helpful. Sake. Why why are you doing that on my blades out? No. But Atom is just not helping at all. No, that's not who I was after. That's still not who I'm after.
Okay. That's a bit better. Right, we've got another alarm bell over here. You then, stop! Messing around. Mm. Did that people from up there? I just wasted a bizet dart. I just wasted a bizet dart, haven't I? I found that be freaking dozy. There we go. Alarm, alarm, whatever. Hmm. Dude, you're, you're dead. I don't know what you're complaining about. Sent for the mission, but it ain't illegal. Come on. Still doesn't help. Someone's got ammo. There's no friend. You weren't much of a friend, Jack Rackham, nor an able sailor, neither. But you were strange and lively, and you made me laugh more than once. And that's enough to make me sorry for seeing you like this. I hope you found a lasting peace down there among the dead. Damn, that was deep. Alright. Ah! Yeah. So, nothing of Jack Rackham except for being an arsehole, so I don't why we're getting all. you know, sad about and contemplated. Mate, you're a bit late to the party. Do you not see all the corpses everywhere? Same goes for you. Bit of thick, aren't you? Inside the, the area or not. So I'm gonna have a quick mooch around just in case he isn't. It's the easiest thing to escape ever. This is literally just the, the outside world at this point. And Atua, he hasn't moved. He's still bleeding down there. Right, can't get through there. That's been established. Oh, I think we could, but it actually just went inside here. Help me, damn it! No. Shit! Alarm! Alarm! Yeah. Ah. 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 
Stuck into oh yeah yes silly sod. Oh my god, you've only gone and got stuck, haven't you? Hey, you silly bugger. Okay. Okay, just in case uh, we need to finish the optional before going to the prison entrance. I'm not 100% sure, to be honest. Everybody's got ammo. Everyone's got sleep darts, but no one's got any berserk darts, which is kind of annoying. some more of these to the south. It might be one of these. No, nope, that's where that's where we were. Oh kitty ant. Mm, must be inside then. Hold that. I think we have been extra cautious with this one, guys. I just don't want to get into a situation where um, I miss another option and I have to redo a mission. So I have to do that three, I have to do that twice in um, Seagull's Ten. I don't really fancy doing it again. I think we got back to the point where uh, Rackham was, so... Yeah, that's Rackham. Well, okay. At least we're definitely sure. We've literally looked everywhere. There's an, if, if we've gone past him at this point... Wait, you. to the southern You're party. There. Hey.
here vein. Was one of, yeah, I was convinced he was one of the uh, the bodies. But seems not, but he doesn't look like he's got much longer anyway. Well, there we go. That was a waste of about 15 minutes. Time you bleed turned up. Mary? Mary, it's me, Edward. Edward? Who's this fella? It's all right, Anne. He's a friend. What's wrong with Mary? She's ill. And her child? They took her. No idea where. Oh! 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 I know it pains my lady, but we must be silent. Can you walk? Oh! Uh, uh. Lean on me, Mary. Come on. Oh, dear. Uh, I can't. Search every cell. Come on, that's it. Oh, come on, Mary. You're all right. You can do it, old girl. Oh, dear. I, I, oh dear. Oh. Stop. Stop, please. I hate leaving you, damn it. Oh. Lift your arm. It's no good. Come on, we're really close, Mary. We can do it. We can do it. Hold on. Just for a moment. There we go. Should have been the one to outlast me. I've done my part. Will you? If you came with me, I could. Mary. I'll be with you, can we? Well, that's another one down. It's bloody dying on us, dying on us at this point. So, Rackham, Vane, Bonnet, uh, Hornigold, Thatch. There's not even that many left, I don't think. I'm just going to basically add a Wally, and I don't know where he's buggered off to. Took the jackdaw with him. Cheeky bastard. Oh, don't even. Don't even. 
Don't even. Don't even. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. What's happened to Mary? What's wrong? Is she gone? Nothing sensible. You haven't earned this, but they suit you. Good fortune to you, Edward. Well, there we go, to suffer without dying. Well, we did die, but every, every sudden other person did. Oh man, yeah. So, he's, he's on the pisser. Oh dear. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Edward's down. Oh, 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 he's not getting up. He's, he's stuck. Oh dear. Bring a bottle. I see some color first. Will this do? In all your years out here, you could never achieve what I've done in one fifth the time. Because you're a good man, Edward, see? Goodness is your disease. That's my prize, Roberts. I give it here. Dude, I think you might Remember be hallucinating. Creed, boy. A short life and a merry one, that is all. The world owes us nothing more than this. So take what you will, and then die before you live to see yourself made a fool. Give it here. That's right, boy, take it. I'll sweet it, you maggot. I'll cut you down. Oh. oh, is it actually Roberts? Oh, are we hallucinating this? Can't be. Oh, well, yeah, this isn't real. Calm, little puppy, and slink back to your kennel. You haven't the metal for my brand of madness. Roberts! <laughs> Roberts! Welcome aboard, Kenway. It's prizes, plunder, and adventure ahead. Are you game? Out of my way, Ben. Raise a glass to freedom, lads. Here's to gentlemen of fortune and women of leisure. To a world full of rogues better than all the kings and queens that kick us about. As gentlemen of fortune, we enjoy plenty and satisfaction, pleasure hey. and ease, liberty and it. power. What man with a sensible mind would choose the former life? For I have dipped my hands in muddied waters, and, withdrawing them, find tis better to be a commander than a common man! I dare you sit on Bonnet like he's a stool. How dare you? Oh, the sharks again. Bloody hell. No more sharks. In fact, we do have another two underwater shipwrecks to deal with anyway, but no more sharks today. No, no, no. I digress. Get, get out. Yeah, look at look at all the, uh, the the bodies you can eat. You don't need to kick up a fuss with some fresh meat. idea that he too was just as strong and capable. So, with a great flapping and rustling of feathers, the jackdaw came down swiftly and clutched at the coat of a large ram. 
But when he tried to fly away, he found he could not lift the animal, for his size and strength were not able to pass. And even as the jackdaw struggled, the ram hardly noticed it was there. Nearby, just across the field, the shepherd saw the fluttering bird and was fighting the animal. Running up, he captured the jackdaw and stripped it. That is No more than two years! You promised me! You left! Well, I needed you the most! But you had me! What keeps you wondering? Do I not make you happy? I'm so close, Caroline! Please! Just let me do this! It's everything you do, I'll spy, Edward! It's not spite that's driving me, Mary! It's courage! Courage for what, man? There's no one left in your life to care! God damn you all! I can handle this! Loud! Always tearing down when you could be building things up or building yourself up if nothing else. Just leave me be! Change course, Edward! Change your bloody course before it's too late! Well, that was eventful. <laughs> One big trip. Come on, Edward. Captain Kenway! You look like a bowl of plum duff. Christ! Oh, I've got a head for ten. On your feet! You put me on the spot, Addy. After leaving me with Robert, I shall have hard feelings about seeing you here. But mostly I'm bloody glad. <laughs> me too, brother. And you'll be chuffed to know your jackdaw is still in one piece. So we set sail. You're leaving. Aye, Edward. But I have another calling elsewhere. Ade, listen. When your heart and your head are ready, visit the assassins. I think you'll understand then. Fair enough. He's going to join the assassins. Class, what a hero. Uh, and we're all stocked up on supplies. We are stocked up on supplies and we're basically free again at last. Uh, so have a look at uh, 81%. Oh, we got the one more memory. Um, and I think this is standalone. Uh, although I'm not going to go into it just because we're getting close to the end of the episode. Uh, I think what we'll do, we'll pop into the shop and I think we might to finish our purchases. So we've got, I think, one more sword set. Yeah. The officer's rapiers. A pair of extremely light rapiers. Praise for their swiftness. Okay. Pistol sets, we're done with. I know that. Just checking. Outfits. We've actually got two more outfits, but we'll just get them both now, though. Uh, we'll get the merchant outfit, a white and grey outfit, typically worn by a rich merchant throughout the West Indies. Uh, actually, I'll, I'll show you what it looks like, and then... Um, Ahoy! We'll get the other one. There you go. It's not the worst looking one, but it's not the... I don't know. Not feeling it, but we're gonna get the last one anyway. The politician's outfit, an outfit quite popular among the English Crown's representatives. And with that, we've purchased all of Edward's upgrades. The only, the only other ones that are left, we have to actually um, unlock. That one's, uh, it's not too bad actually. It's like a different shade of the original one. Uh, so if you just have a look at our um, Edward upgrades, so swords, the ones we've not got, contracts and social treasure. I still not got this one. Third social treasure. Uh, uh, community challenges we can't do. Uh, contracts we're working on, obviously. Pistol sets. Uh, naval contracts. Community challenges. Outfits. Community challenges. Main still A. That's it. Okay. Hmm. Alright. Okay, so database. People. Probably be Mary, I think. Yeah. Died in Jamaica.
Hmm. Yeah, what happened to uh, Mary's child? That is interesting. Okay. And uh, statistics. 85%. That is quite the jump. We've got 4% since last time. That is fantastic. Okay. And that'll do. So uh, we're definitely going to take some time out to work on um, some side stuff because we've done a lot of uh, the main story. Obviously, we, we, we blasted through sequence 10 and we've basically done with sequence 11 as well. And we've got uh, two more regions to cover. So I think maybe uh, we will focus on getting all of the additional side stuff that we can do in these two regions done next. And with that, all the treasures. We'll finish off sequence 11. Then we shall... Oh, I'll look into if sequence 12 leads directly into 13. Um, if it does, then after that we'll take on the naval ships. Uh, if it doesn't, we'll do sequence 12 as well. Uh, and the, I think after that we can finish up the present day stuff, and then we'll uh, do the legendary ships. I just don't want to, obviously, like, obviously, we're towards the end of the game now. We definitely need to be uh, wrapping up our business. Um, but yeah, so I think um, in terms of our screen work now, the only things we're going to be doing is one, I'm going to see if I can find that final social chest so that I can get that last outfit, and that's also an Abstergo challenge. And then. Um, Get the rest of the supplies needed to fully upgrade the jackdaw. And I think that really about covers it. So how many locations we've got left? We've got uh, one, two, three, five. That's it. Five more locations and uncharted collectibles in two regions. So that's not too shabby, guys. That's not too shabby at all. So that is where we're going to end it for today. In the next episode, we will head to one of our new regions and start cracking down on the side stuff. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and be sure to share the video. And I will see you guys in episode 42. Bye, guys. Good.